an occasion to celebrate all kinds of love. And one of the things we love, of course, mm -hmm. around here is science. So the Science Center's here. It's going, look, right oh, there. It wasn't, <laughs> okay. A little behind the scenes. Valentine's. That's right. You brought a heart. We did. I did bring a heart. A real I mean, heart. Yeah. That's exactly what the symbol of and Valentine's Day. And it wasn't until Day. I walked up here that I could smell that. A little bit. So I'm really happy you guys did the food segment yes, right before this you. one at least and not <laughs> after. Yeah, so then. But uh, yeah, so we do have a heart right here. Mm. Um, what symbol. kind of heart is this? So this is a sheep's heart. A mm. sheep's heart. It's very similar to uh, a human heart. So if you take your fist and put it right up against your chest. That's about how big your heart is and about where it is too. So right up, right up about here. So they're about the same size. And that symbol that is all about Valentine's Day, mm -hmm. that heart, came from early anatomical drawings of the heart. And there's mm -hmm. some uh, more science behind it. There's another theory that um, it was a seed pod back in Greek oh. and Roman times mm -hmm. that was very valuable. So it became a symbol of love and money, I guess, too. There you but, go. Um, we have a great workshop going on where people can learn more about the heart. It's the muscle that pumps blood around your body. How heavy is that, by the way? Would, mm, no, I don't want to touch it, but I just... Touch it <laughs> no, thank to. you. It's a few ounces. Okay. Um, but go ahead and pick up that uh, tennis ball have right there. Have these touched both the heart? No, they have not. Okay, so just making you sure. You can both pick it up in your right hand. <laughs> Give it a good squeeze. And if you can make a dent in it, that's about the amount of power your heart oh, is wow. squeezing with. So pumping I'm blood not as around. Strong as he I know is. it's so hard. I did it yesterday and realized how weak my hands are, but how strong my heart must be. So you can learn all about that in our heart healthy lab mm. at the science center. I didn't center. know that. That's actually fascinating. Isn't that crazy? I had no idea. Well, it, like I said, we can teach you all about the heart. We can show you your true heart strings actually in that lab. But if flowers are more your thing, so mm -hmm. from hearts to flowers, sure. uh -huh. uh, we also have a workshop going on where master florists from Create Yours come to our Create Makerspace and we'll teach you how to design your own master. Oh, oh pieces. So that's You can be cool. an expert every time. I always wondered how they did this. And do you get and to make those too? You do. Oh, so that's beautiful. All of these etched pieces and then uh, the laser cut box here, you can design it yourself, customize it on our laser cutters, however you want. That's Sunday. This Sunday that only. Is cool. This Sunday only. Tomorrow. So that's you have cool. to yes. sign up ahead of time or just show up? Um, you know what? Check out our website for okay. the registration and okay. it'll tell you all of the information right there on azscience.org. Okay. Can but, okay, so what is Valentine's without nothing? The Valentine's. So go ahead inside these. I want you to go ahead and smack it. Give it a good smack. Oh, I hard opened to it. Do. Okay. Oh, did you open it? Yeah. <laughs> Give this one a well, go. I don't, oh, you know it opened. Yeah. Mine it just open popped. All right. So it. this one. Yep. And these are self-inflating balloons. And because oh. they're not. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. So here's one. They're really hard I'm sometimes. Not very sure. Let, let, me nice. let me try. But that's okay. Oh, there it goes. Show you how to do it. You did it at home. So I think these are Wait, all the range. They're absolutely the... adorable. What do you hear? So Ty, since you've you got one, some yeah, air. what do you hear you inside there? You can hear some air coming out. It sounds like air coming out, some mm -hmm. hissing and fizzing. So mm -hmm. this is oh, the same science like as when we did the volcanoes, the baking soda and vinegar. Like good scientists, we yeah. ripped these bad boys open. It's citric acid it's and, um, oh, it is touching the heart. Yeah. We'll move that over. <laughs> citric acid and baking soda in there. So a little bit of chemistry in these like very popular Valentine's. There you go, Anita, so you did it. You did it. There you go. We can try these at home. Don't hold it too tight because it is going to pop. So we'll oh, there it goes. <laughs> out here. But if you wanted to try this at home, uh -huh. what science without being able to do a little at home? We've made our own. We've got a baggie here with vinegar inside and some baking soda. Don't worry, really that. Seconds, that one for okay. you too. Thank you. So we're gonna Do just we pop, pop it? this in here. And you're gonna smash it. You can go ahead and just Ready? give it a good smash. You I don't want to go too. That. I don't want to make it explode. <laughs> there you oh. go. You do want to make it explode. It has this to happen. This is fantastic. So if you're in your kitchen, it's just so how much how much vinegar? So about. Three quarters of a cup of vinegar and then three tablespoons of baking soda. There you go. There you go, you got it. She's really taking out her frustrations here this morning. Calm down. And you can see right here, I mean, it's inflating instantly. And then if you want to get really crazy, and I'll just do this one really quickly because I, I love it. Same thing. You can watch. Is there uh, baking powder um, there in there? There is. So you can put that over this. top. You want to go ahead and sure. dump it? Yeah. I put baking soda in these in balloons, the balloons. And then flip it over the other way. Oh, the other way. Yep, the other oh, way. Oh, sorry. There you go. Oh, that's see cool. It start to. Inflate that balloon I with all like the gas. I'm a science failure today. No, that's okay. And I've got little messages written on them. So if you're at home with your kids, you can blow them up, write secret messages oh. so they get really small. Oh, that's cool. And then blow so them back sweet. up as a surprise. Okay, how can people find all this fun, neat stuff? All of these activities and so it's much more at Arizona Science Center, <laughs> both as part of uh, Valentine's Day this February and all the time. So we're always there for your Ooh. science entertainment. I know, look, you did a really this great job. This Thank, you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. She's hiding. Thank you. We'll be right back. Well, not enough. Going on now. It's the